So, who are you? So, um, my name is Sean Weisfeld. I am a C Sharp MVP. I have been for about three years now, a little over three years now. Um, I just got my third award in January um, from Dallas, Texas. You got to say it like that. It's Dallas, Texas. That sounds cool. Yeah. Texas. Yeah. Okay. So we got Texas. And where are you from? Uh, my name is Andy Malone. Uh -huh. I'm uh, an MVP in uh, setup and deployment. Mm -hmm. I come from Stirling in Scotland. Yes. So, quite a distance away from here. Um, I've been an MVP now that's just coming into my third year. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, it's awesome. Yes. So, so what, do you, what do you like so much about being an MVP? Oh, God, where do you go? Um, the community is just absolutely awesome. The, the chance to meet nice people like you and and you don't, you don't know me that well. Yeah, no, that's, a, that's a well. That's a, when, I, when I first met you, I thought you looked a little bit shady, but <laughs> no. But seriously, just the um, the whole experience, uh -huh. the MVP award for me is is just uh, it's not just a, a fantastic trophy to say yeah. thank you. It, it's uh, as as we discussed earlier, it's kind of it's stuff that you would do already, you know. Yep. You know, and I I love just getting out there, and I'm passionate about technology and about my, my area and, and just being able to evangelize that with people yeah. is just awesome. Yeah, I, de I yeah, I definitely agree 100%. It's it, it the stuff I do because I the stuff I did to become an MVP is um, stuff that I would have done anyway and stuff that I would continue to do um, if they decided that I was no longer qualified or if they found somebody better. But it would it's it's a great um it's it's a great uh, honor to be uh, to be given the little badge and and, and the, uh, the the lucite plaque and whatnot. Um, but I think it's more than that because it, it also um, it also gives us the uh, some level of of prestige in the community um, and the, and the um, the interaction that we get with Microsoft yeah. and um, other vendors right. just because we're MVPs. Um, okay. I, I yeah. was going to say just yeah. one thing I've got to add is that uh, I don't know about you, but, uh -huh. but we we have once a year we have something called MVP Summit, right? Yeah. And there's no place where I think you can sit around a table with guys from 20 or 30 different countries and just have an amazing conversation like that yeah. and make friends in that yes. kind of community, you know? I think that's just uh, absolutely wrong. Yes, I, so, I, I, I was going to say, what uh -huh. do you, what kind of activities do you do? I mean, are you online? Are you offline? Or? Uh, I, 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 so I do blog, yeah, right? Um, but my, uh, the, the blog isn't the, uh, the, the, uh, the, the sum of my parts, right? So the the, the um, majority of the time I spend actually out in the community, um, either attending user group meetings, speaking at user group meetings, helping to organize user group meetings, um, getting content to folks, getting resources to folks that need it, um, answering questions that people have. Like in, in the background, I mean, one of the uh, it, it's a funny story, right? So when I when I, I used to be the uh, I used to run a user group in Florida, and I just recently moved to Texas, and when I got there, I said, well. After we had our user group meetings in Florida, we used to go out for, for a, uh, uh, as you guys would say, a pint. Sure. We used to go out for a pint, and we would have such great conversations around the table, um, around the table after the user group meetings. It would be like, it'd be like a, this little brain trust of folks where everybody has different ideas and, yeah. and being able to put that stuff together. So I just recently started a new user group. That, that's the whole goal of the user group right. is just to get around, just get a bunch of guys together or sure. girls and so we, so we can talk about technology and stuff. And we even do it virtually so you can even come. Everybody can come. But you're an IT pro, but we won't hold that against you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm. Uh, I, I was going to just say one yeah. of the great things. I mean, about being part of this whole mm -hmm. community is that you get to come along to amazing conferences like yes. TechEd and actually speak to people. Yes. I mean, yesterday I stood up in front of 400 people and they yeah. closed the doors and they wouldn't let any more in. And just to be here at TechEd yep. is just a, an amazing experience and a great honor. You know. Well, and the, the, which one call it? I mean, it, it's 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 funny. You you walk around Tech Ed, and it's like looking at the cover of of all the of all the books that you've that you've yeah, read, absolutely. and meeting all the, all the names behind. Videos. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I it's know. A, you. Yeah. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's like I, I I I've been I've been listening to you talk for years, and there you are, and and I, and and I think people get people get that when they speak to other MVPs, right? Yeah, yeah. Because because the MVPs are out there, they're writing books, they're they're talking at user groups, they're yeah. they're they're talking at Places like TechEd or other conferences or code camps or what have you, all over the place. Or That's right. IT pro camps. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, we have so. It's, a, it's a lovely couple. Obviously. Yeah. <laughs> the uh, I, I was going to say another thing that TechEd yeah. right yeah. is. Uh, I mean, this week 
have you been on done kind of booth duty at TechEd this week? Have you been involved yeah. with that, or are you just attending? TechEd? Yes. So the majority of my time I spend at the booths here at okay. TechEd because I like talking to the folks, right? Okay. It's a great opportunity to not only talk to other MVPs, other industry leaders, but also the regular folks, right? The people that are in the cubes cranking out the code in, in, in my case, as a yeah. developer. And those the people that are that in the trenches. That's really important yes. to these guys, you know, to, to, to be able to come to these booths yes. and just ask questions to, to Microsoft yeah. product groups and also yeah. to MVPs yeah. as well. It, Great well, it, it, it's great because they, sh they share our passion, right? That's right. It's, it's, I, I come home and it's, you, you talk to folks outside of the IT field and you're telling them about this cool thing that you did or this cool thing you learned or, or something of that nature yeah. and they're just like, well, that's great. Yeah. But when you talk to other IT folks, when you talk to other developers and, and, and they get it, they, yeah. they see the passion, they, they can feel that, that excitement that you feel about that thing and you can share that with them, yeah. that's, that's, just, that's just cool. Well, it's been really great. <coughs> Excuse me. To, yes, and, it's been uh, a pleasure talking to you as well. Wonderful meeting, yes. even though you're a coder. But yes, that's great. don't hold it against me. I won't. Thank you. <laughs>